All right, so welcome back, everybody, playing some more Brotato. It's been a little while for me. And, uh, yeah, we're playing as a mutant. So this guy gets plus 200% XP gain, but plus 50% item price. So I've been having some decent luck playing SMG Harvester mutants. I say Harvester mutant, I mean, like, <laughs> investing in harvesting, because the fact that everything's more expensive, it means it's probably a good idea to try and invest in the economy a bit. Get some good returns. But, yeah, taking the SMG just because I like that weapon. <laughs> I like it, and it actually does feel kind of strong if you can find a few of them early. Right, um, I don't think any of these do enough. I will buy some harvesting to start. Yeah, again, none of these are it. Damage? Oh, homo roll. Range damage up. Gonna take that over harvesting. And then a luck up. Nice. Another SMG. Very cool. Uh, leave the rest of these. I do really want to find... Oh, you're so expensive. No, I don't think I can buy a gentle alien yet. I need to find as many um, SMGs as I can early. Not necessarily on the first, like, you know, two waves, but... Yeah, I've had a couple of runs today where I spent way too long getting back to six weapons, and you don't want to still have, like, four weapons by wave, like, ten or something. It's just not good. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to try and be ahead of the curve on that one. Account for some future bad luck. <laughs> Alright. Well, at least I killed those things, but yeah, I didn't get much money there. Um, take another luck up. I think that's fine. Take the harvesting. And yeah, buy SMG. I really do want Scar, but I'm not... I don't think it's worth taking over a weapon there, even if I could afford it, which I couldn't. <laughs> okay, health pack. Cool. It's not actually cool. I don't need that. Yeah, I do wonder how glass cannony I should make my runs, because I feel like this is the sort of character where you can get very powerful. So I don't know whether to just keep investing in that, because I haven't only really died to elites, so I could probably just... Yeah. Take a damage up. Take a damage up, take a... take a roll. Take another damage up. And... Okay, so we actually do have a Horde Wave. Horde Wave is going to be Wave 11, then we have two elites later. Um, take you now, leave the rest. Continue leaving the rest. Small magazine's kind of cool. And I think uh, Lumberjack Shirt could be nice as well. It'd be way better if I could get some piercing damage or something, but... Yeah. <laughs> I could see myself being in a situation where I run past a tree and don't fully kill it, so... I think investing, like, 33 materials for Lumberjack Shirt is quite nice. What would be a lot nicer, though, is just finding some tree upgrades. Genuinely my favorite thing to see. Unlike <laughs> any run. Okay. Uh, this is going pretty well. Yeah, not really struggling to kill things. Most things are dying instead of just despawning. Uh, still don't want regen. Oh, another luck up. I feel like I'm getting terrible things at the moment. Yeah, another luck. Uh, SMG. Yeah, we take both of these, I guess. And I'll roll once. Another SMG, Grace. Okay. Um, Acid is kind of tempting, but again, I'm going to go really hard on just building up money to start. Like, I want to invest really hard in my own sort of offensive outputs and um, harvesting. I'm hoping I can afford to not, <laughs> like, buy armor and dodge and HP. A bit of healing would be good, though, and with the sort of build I'm going for at the moment, maybe, maybe looking into lifesteal would be pretty good for that. There are some very good um, item stats as well. Specifically thinking about, <laughs> I think it's Jetpack and Finn. I think they're both like massive speed ups as well, which are always, always appreciated. I feel like I'm normally hurting for speed when I play this game. Okay. Uh, sure, more range damage. I will take a bit of armor. I think that is fine, because we are going to need it at some point. I just didn't really want to invest too hard early. Yeah, I'm not going for either of these. I don't want engineering. We don't have any of the other thing. Yeah, freeze you then. Leave landmines. It's both expensive and not going to be very good. Uh, everything's dying very quickly. That's kind of cool. I do wish there were more enemies, though. <laughs> I know I rolled past a... Or at least I think I rolled past a gentle alien earlier. But it wasn't a good idea. Like, it's never good to buy gentle aliens. Like, your first and only item. When you're taking gentle aliens, it's when you're already like in an okay spot. Or at least have six weapons or something, so you're actually getting full benefit of 
uh, e-bonus damage. So yeah, I want to get to six SMGs as soon as I can, and I'd love to find miniguns as well. I swear, it's been forever since I've had a minigun game. Dude, the flies, I hate them. <laughs> they spam out so much junk. Uh, more damage for every permanent speed you have. I'm going to take that, and I'm going to risk um, having some negative damage for now. I'll take that. No. Uh, it feels so bad. It's barely better than the tier 2. <laughs> Roll this. Oh, God. It's getting so expensive. Okay. Um, buy both of these. Roll once. Um... Yeah, leave that. I really want to find some speed-ups. Because speed is now damage, and speed is just great anyway. Oh, you don't get any money when you kill the nubs. That's it. <laughs> I've been wondering the last like couple of runs whether it's worth killing the nubs, but... Yeah, I guess the things that come out don't give you much money, but you don't get any money if you just kill the things they spawn from. I think. Oh, there's a guy. Yo, present. Nice. Yeah, they aren't too bad. They die pretty quickly. I'm not going to avoid any more of the egg things I see, though. I just want to make sure I'm picking up like, maximum money and going to trees. Yeah. Okay, not an insane wave, but we're getting there. Luckily, Tooth is alright. Um, bit of armor for... Yeah, that's, that's probably fine as well. Okay, I'm going to roll, because if I can find speed, not attack speed, it would be very cool. Actually, no, I will take attack speed. <laughs> More luck, fine. Um, small magazine, yes. Roll. The SMG, I can just buy that. I'm actually going to take fertilizer first, though. Keep that, like, locked up. If it was, if we were going into wave 9, then I would have bought the weapon instead, but... Yeah, I can afford to agree to Elizabeth's. I really want to find some speed ups though, because I think that's what I'm going to hinge my damage scaling on. Ow. <laughs> I thought it was going to die so much sooner. Uh, I need to wait until I actually see the animation before I start walking into things. Okay. That one? I think one of them despawned instead of actually dying. I feel like it didn't drop any materials. Going well. I see that tree. I can work my way over there slowly. Or, you know, beelining it, but relatively slowly because I am very slow. <laughs> Shout out to my, like, negative five speed stat. Okay, armor at the cost of damage. Probably. I don't want negative damage, but I think that's probably a good thing. Um, Lifesteal, that could be my healing. Yeah, I think I am going to take that. Oh, I, I just feel like I need to take all of these things. More attack speeds, more range. No, I'm probably fine. Uh, Beam Teacher is very cool. It is a lifesteal down, though. But yeah, I'm definitely going to take that. Um, I may leave Piggy Bag. Piggy Bank? I don't know. It'll probably pay out over time. Yeah, we can freeze it. I know Pistol would be fine, but... <laughs> I like to, like, lock in a single build. And here we go. It's wave 9, the money wave. Hooray! Hopefully I'll actually get something decent out of this. Okay. No, this is just great. It's actually just like popping popcorn. <laughs> the bigger ones are less like that, but yeah. Lot of money. I expect I'm gonna finish with like 600 maybe. Maybe that's being way too, too optimistic. <laughs> maybe like 450. I don't know. We'll see. At least I'm killing things pretty fast. Like, I don't think I'm seeing anything just despawning. Because it's been, like, in existence too long. Oh, it's such a satisfying sound. Six SMGs. <laughs> Non-stop firing. Uh, I don't think I saw any trees this wave. I don't know if they were, like, hiding on the edges or something. Oh, I'm taking a scar. Oh, fine. Fine. Take that. Take the massive speed up. Um, roll HP. Take a luck up. <laughs> oh my god. Harvesting, huh? 
Um, what's my... I'm only at 30 HP. I have a bit of lifesteal, but it's not insane. <laughs> it's really not great. Uh, I'm going to invest. Let's see if we can make that work. And I actually don't want more damage, because if I'm healing based on how many times I hit, then I'd rather have attack speed over damage. Uh, more attack speed and crit chance and range. Yes, it is a, a thing down. Oh, we can take Ritual as well. I know it's kind of ruining Piggy Bank, but I need the lifesteal. So yeah, we can we can just ignore normal regen then. And I'm hoping having this blood donation thing isn't going to screw up my build too much. Because I genuinely have no idea how much I'm going to be healing up like this. It seems stable. No, that's good. Okay. <laughs> I would feel a lot safer if I had a lot more HP. Because if I had a very slow round or something, maybe I wouldn't be able to um, shoot nonstop. But at least I know that if I'm constantly shooting, then I can outheal the damage. I think I'm taking more damage now. Oh, you know, my health is getting low. Yeah, no, this is fine. Okay, so I want to find a minigun. That is actually just my dream. Every time I have an SMG build, I'm just basically just waiting to find a minigun. And usually never do. <laughs> but it's just like, in my mind, this is the better SMG. It's very fast firing and, you know, higher rarity in general. Okay, that was a pretty good wave. Um, yes, I will take that. I will also take the damage up. I know I need speed, but yeah. Um, I'm going to leave all of this, though. Let's roll a bit. Lifesteal? No. No. I think there's an elite coming up, though, so I'm going to grab the armor, I think. I want to be more survivable. And you know what? Take crit over harvesting here. Vigilante ring is very cool. I don't believe I can buy both of these, so I think it's better to take the vigilante ring right away. More HP, and then <laughs> consumables explode. Yeah, I'm just going to ignore that. And it's actually a horde wave. It's not an elite. Okay, excellent. Okay, save the rest of the money for piggy bank. It's not a lot, but I don't know. Maybe it's worth more than rolling with only like three open slots. Okay, so horde wave could get dangerous, but I do have decent healing and um, a reasonable, <laughs> reasonable amount of armor now. So I'm hoping... Oh, I actually don't know how I'm going to handle this one. It's okay right now, but I feel like it's going to get very bad and, yeah, not a lot of amount of time. Okay. I'm still, like, working my way through. I do see that tree. I may leave it until, like, right at the end, or <laughs> not at all. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Health packs, please. Okay. I'm not going to be able to pick up most of these materials. That's just how this one's going to go. It's way too hard to get to it. Hold on, we can survive. Just don't bother don't bother with the tree, just live. There we go. Okay, yeah. <laughs> more HP, fine. Um more lifesteal, maybe. No, I, I should I can definitely find better things here. Definitely not touching Harp's thing. That is the biggest scam I've ever seen. <laughs> Keep rolling. Yeah, I'm taking speed. Speed is damage. And it's also just um nice to have. Uh, more attack speed. I don't care about the structure thing, but I may just buy this for the attack speed. Although, I don't know. I want this, definitely. I don't think I care about Tyler. Um, like, I don't know. <laughs> Is it worth it just for the attack speed? I'm going to say no. Let's roll a little bit. What's my crit looking like? 12. Oh, no, wait. You don't even need crit, right? I may buy both of these, though. So a little bit of a damage down, but like the luck and the extra money is probably going to make that pay. And one bullet dealing 12 damage is fired from an enemy corpse when they die, but it cripples my range. Um, that could be good. I don't know. No. Ah, let, let's try it. I never buy that. I don't know. How much... How many shots does it take to kill something? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what build that sort of fits with. Obviously, I'd need to have a very high um, range damage stats, which I would like to increase, which is the only reason why I'm sort of entertaining the idea. But, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if the, you know, 19 damage is worth it. And, 
Yeah, I'm loving, <laughs> loving lifesteal. I never do lifesteal builds. But this, this is very satisfying. Okay. Wait, can you stack multiple blood donation things? Are they unique? I don't know if I've ever had two in the same run before. I also don't think it'd be a very good idea, even if I do have <laughs> reasonable healing, but... I don't know, I would like more harvesting. If the game would be so kind. More speed. It's a bit of a range down, but sure. And I think a med turret may be worth it. Like, it's at least worth, like, 30. And more attack speed, yes. Attack speeds. Um, armor? No, we can do better than armor. Rolling. Uh, let's take the luck, actually. Yo, Peacock. Peacock is very nice. Do I... I might as well do it now. I don't really know what happens on the different waves, so I don't know when to save it for. If there's a Horde wave coming up, I may save it for that, even though that's also very risky. But yeah, I'm just going to buy both of these. Leave that. Uh, another SMG, thankfully. I can upgrade that a bit. And I actually want to up my... my thing there. I think Alien Babies may be worth it. Yeah, that's not that much of a speed up. I don't know about Cyclops Worm, though. I do want some more range. The damage is nice, but I don't want to have, like, no range. Yeah, I have no idea what this is about. Like, I feel like there's not a lot of enemies around, so the, um... Baby with a beard shot isn't, uh, as visible, but... I have no clue if that was worth getting or not. Probably not, considering it was so expensive. Okay. Though, an SMG. It's all I'm asking for. And honestly, I'm really surprised that it's so rare, because I never see them. Not SMG, sorry, minigun. I never see miniguns. I see all sorts of other epic rarity weapons, but not that specifically. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know if they're just rare or something. Also, I need to be very careful, because I forgot I take, like. I don't think it's double damage, but plus 50% damage or something this way because of the peacock. Let me collect some stuff. I got a bit, but I did, like, miss a hundred. And Gentle Alien, I will take that. I will also take Alien Eyes, because it's worth something, not a lot. <laughs> and I'm taking more speed. Take the speed, ignore... I don't know, can I go for a really tanky lifesteal build? Let's try it. <laughs> Let's just get that. And, oh, Glass Cannon. Um, honestly, it's probably not worth the armor down, but I can't turn down a glass cannon, so I'm going to be combining these, buying you, buying you, keep you frozen, and yeah, I'm not going to roll. Next wave, we have to fight an elite, so I don't know if I'm going to actively try and kill it, or just, you know, run away from it, <laughs> try and outlive it, so, you know, let the clock run out. Because my runs keep dying to elites. It's actually like 90% of the reason why my runs die. And the other 10% is probably a horde wave. <laughs> they very rarely die on normal stuff. Sometimes it is greed, actually. I've definitely died because I've gone greedy at like the end of a wave. I've been like, oh, there's so much money in the middle, I want to collect it. And then I run in the middle and then <laughs> insta-die because I'm always a glass cannon. But yeah, if I am going to be going for... um bit more of a tanky build, I do need to try and get that armor back. Because having loads of healing is great, but it's not great if you just end up getting one shot, you know? I want to have lots of HP, lots of armor, and then I can actually use my healing. Is that where I just forget about it and go <laughs> off the deep end in DPS? Lean into being a glass cannon even more. And yes, I will take another metal detector, and we got our armor back! Perfect. Um, I... I it's too late. I don't want to. Let's roll that. I don't want any of this. Uh, yes, I will take even more armor. <laughs> I am okay with that. Uh, I am going to take this. I don't think I'm going to take Propeller Hat anymore. Another SMG is cool, and I will buy it right away. More armor and dodge. I'll freeze you, but I'm not going to buy you yet. Actually, no, I will, because this is an elite wave, and I want to be as <laughs> survival as possible. Okay, so what do you do? You make the nubs, right. Okay, he's probably not going to be too bad. I can't remember what his other stages are, though. He just wanders around and shoots out orbs. That's fine. Oh, this guy's like, no trouble. <laughs> He's so much nicer than the one that has, like, constant arrows coming out of him. 
Okay, he's dead. There is a... Oh, present there. There is a special present that will heal me to full if I ever need that, so I'm gonna leave that until the end. I don't know if there's a benefit to picking it up right away. I assume not. I think it's just a full heal and it gets sucked to you at the end either way. But, yeah, let's grab that. <laughs> grab that. I think I some decent money this uh, wave as well. Feeling pretty strong. Build another tree. Got more presents though. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. Okay, uh, more XP gain, but less max HP. I am going to take that, but this seems like a, a horrible item. Yo, more lifesteal, yes. Octopus, welcome. No, I'm going to roll this lifesteal. I do need other stuff. Because, like, speed is just a flat damage increase. You know, as well as actual speed. I'm probably going to take crit chance, though. I think that's kind of cool as well. More attack speed is always nice, too. Um, HP, damage, armor, speed, less crit chance. I don't have much crit chance, but I still think that's definitely worth taking. Um, dangerous bunny, maybe. Sunglasses, I don't know. I do have a lot of armor now, so it's probably worth taking. You know what? Let's just... Let's do it that way. I don't even know if dangerous bunny's worth it. We're so close to the end. Ignore it. Ignore it. It's bad. Don't get baited. I never liked that. I, I never liked that item in the first place. I just saw a lot of people saying that it was very good, but I feel like I barely roll, so it's probably not even saving much. Like on this character, maybe because I think the rolls are also more expensive. But for the most part, I don't roll a ton, and if I'm only going to be rolling like once or twice a wave, it's going to be saving me like you know, ten gold, ten materials. This is great. So survivable. Love it. Okay, can I collect more of these? Thank you. Keep hearing a popping sound, and I'm not sure what it is. What is that sound? Is it my... Oh, I think it's my med turret healing me. <laughs> I think that might be what it is. Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. Alright, so more range damage. That would be very good. Yeah, we're just going to take that. I need that. I don't think that does too much for me. I'm taking the speed up. <laughs> you know I'm taking the speed up. Um, Hunting trophy maybe could have been okay, but it's it's way too late. I don't think it does anything anymore. So ignore that. Vigilante ring. It's, it's a bit of a bit of a damage up. It's very mild though, and it's also very expensive. Um, I think I'm going to just buy a load of stuff now, and I'm going to ignore this. Yeah, let's just try and get to, like, max, max epic SMGs. Or miniguns. I would still very much like to find a minigun. <laughs> okay. So we did get a pretty significant damage up there, because every range damage up I get is, you know, bonus damage per shot. And considering I'm shooting so much, that's a... Uh, Probably going to scale a lot more significantly than normal damage ups. At least while I have a low range damage stat. Because I think we're, what, we were barely over 12 when I got it or something? I'm at like 16 now, maybe? Yeah, we'd love to find more of those. Plus it helps out the baby with a bit. Because now I think that shot that bounces around is um, going to be doing more too. Okay. I just need to remember, if I ever take Triangle of Power, do not do it when you have blood donation or like any sort of build where you're trying to take loads of damage. Oh, I am taking that. Um, leaving you though. I can maybe take another Alien Eyes. It's done like 10,000 damage. Uh, it's kind of tempting. I don't think it's actually that good, but I'm going to take it because it's funny. So yeah, buy one of those. Uh... Freeze you. I'm not going to buy it this turn. I think this turn I'm just going to let it roll. So I'm going to save my... Save a bit of money for piggy bank. And yeah, then I'll buy that like next turn. And just ignore any future health ups. And there is an Elise. Oh, you're the arrow one, right? Okay. As long as I can deal with the other things around me, I'm not that worried about them. But yeah. Last few times I fought this guy, I couldn't deal with all the small ones behind me. So he was just like... Pinning me against the swarm. Can you die, please? This would be a lot easier if there weren't arrows everywhere. There we go. <laughs> Alright, we're safe. 
to the tree. It's kind of sad that because I have blood donation, I, I know it's not called that by the way, I'm sorry if I'm <laughs> triggering everyone by using the wrong word, but I can't remember what it's called. But yeah, the fact that I'm losing HP constantly, but not much, it just means that the um, those little health packs are always getting sucked up even though I'm basically full HP. And it's kind of sad. I normally like leaving those on the floor because it's like, you know, it's, it's good healing if you ever get burst down. Alright, we're at like a thousand money. Yo, more luck for every crit chance you have. Uh, I mean, I do have some crit chance. Oh, I'm, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. I never see lucky coin. I can maybe fix my range as well. I was worried about that. But let's see if we can find either a higher rarity thing or a speed up. Actually, no, these are getting horrifically expensive, okay? <laughs> I didn't realize how expensive the rolls were getting. Um, just buy it. Buy it and roll a bit. I will take you. I'm not going to take you because you're also damaged down. And freeze it by it next turn. Yes. <laughs> okay. So I saved a little bit of money for my piggy bank. But honestly, I, I think it probably wasn't worth taking because inflation in this game gets crazy. Because if it's only earned me, like, I don't know, maybe 400 by now. I'm not really sure. Then uh, it's maybe kind of good, but probably not worth them. Um, probably not worth it. Also, why is some of the things like... I swear some of these things have really weird death animations. <laughs> like spinning and moving. Whatever. It's fine. I'm just losing my mind. I have not been sleeping well recently. I'm dying. Okay. Oh, this is nice. I genuinely feel pretty safe. <laughs> I'm very, very tanky, so I'm not that afraid of just getting one shot by something out of the blue. And uh, on top of that, I'm also just very strong. So yeah, this is great. Lovely run. Be fighting the boss next. Wish I had collected more materials. I forgot, but whatever. Uh, yeah, ignore that. Ignore, ignore. Speed up. I know the range thing, but speed. <laughs> uh, more life steal. I really don't need it. How much are we getting at the moment? We could have like a 20% chance to heal for one HP per shot. It is a max of 10 HP a second, but I would never need that much. Uh, yeah, this is the most interesting. We'll just take that. Giant Belt. Critical hits deal 10% of an enemy's current health as bonus damage. 1% for bosses and elites. I don't think I've ever had this. I'm taking that. <laughs> that seems really overpowered when I'm spamming out this many shots. Yeah, take it. Okay, leave this one behind. Um, Nothing here. We're basically just rolling down until the end. I'm not going to touch the missile because I want max rate of high. I don't think gentle alien is the best. Uh, HP, luck, and less damage. So, objectively bad. But I do have a lot of damage. No, no, I, I can't raise my HP anymore. Yeah, no, I don't want that just for the luck. That's sad. <laughs> glass cannon. Uh, it's between glass cannon and just upgrading one of my guns. It's 25% damage. That's not insignificant. I'm taking that, and I'm freezing SMG for next game. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's see if we can kill these guys as well. I'm not sure if I'm going to focus on one before the other, but it looks like I'm doing a lot of damage, so... Yeah, I'm probably... Probably pretty safe to just shoot at whatever I'm nearest at the time. Yeah, there we go. It's over. Hold on. There we go. <laughs> we did it. I have no idea if Gi uh, Giant Belt did much work or not, but I did seem to kill the bosses very quickly. So I'm going to I'm going to say it was the Giant Belt. But yeah, that was a pretty nice run. Lots of lots of cool stuff here. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. It does help me out a lot. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.